Well, hello, my YouTube family. Another Monday in the books, people. Another Monday in the books. So, let us get started on this. Look at it, people. And this is a gift from my cousin Janet. So, Janet, if you're watching, thank you so much, girl. I don't think I have this one. I could, but I'm not sure. I'm not really sure. So, let us start off with the liner, shall we? As we always do, people. My scratched up Mac in current. There it is. Current. Uh, lined. It's just a shade darker than the lipstick, which is perfect. And the lipstick is a Wet n Wild lipstick in the color Dark Wine, number C536A. I don't know if y'all be able to see that. There it is. You won't be able to see it. And this is what Dark Wine looks like, people. What? Look at that beauty. What? Swatch. Here comes the swatch. It's so creamy. It's so creamy and so nice. And as you can see, it's got a hint of its own little sheen to it. Moisturizing. Yeah, I can't complain about this at all. Uh-uh. <laughs> just, it's just beautiful, people. It is just beautiful. So this is Wet n Wild in dark wine. Really creamy. Really, really creamy. Is this like a new packaging, people? Is this new? It's been years, as you well know. It's been, I can't really say years, but it's been so long since I've done any kind of haul of any kind with good reason. I mean, I know my birthday came and left and normally I go shopping with my girlfriend, Carrie. Not this year, people, at least not right now. Maybe for Christmas, I'm not even sure. I just need to get my feet back on the ground as far as my finances are concerned. Bills, I, once those are off my shoulders and off my mind and off my back, then we will proceed. But every now and then you will see that I have purchased maybe one or two things from Amazon. I've got an Amazon order um, in the cart for this Friday, but it's it's not fun stuff. It's not it's his um litter tray. I ordered some ink for my printer. Not fun stuff, people. Not really fun stuff. I mean, I have stuff waiting in the wings, like in the in my shopping, well, not the shopping cart so much, but, you know, put on the side. I've got so many things that I want to get. Ooh, there's a, there's a Charlotte Tilbury uh, highlighter dupe. I want to get that because I can't afford Charlotte Tilbury nothing. She looks like she has good stuff. I just can't afford it. Okay. There are some other like lip glosses that I want to get. There's some lipsticks that I want to get. Not so much blushes, but there's some, you know, there's some other stuff out there that I would really like to um purchase. But finances being what they are, I mean, I'm just getting my feet back on the ground. And I've got so much I'm I'm I've got so much debt. It's ridiculous. So I want to at least put a dent in that first, be responsible, and just shop my sash, which I've been doing. I'm having fun with it. Um, I do have to say, however, hold on. From my very, oops, from my very last Sephora haul, when I placed... Well, it's, they're really Ulta. I think they were really Ulta. My, my last Ulta. Ulta slash Sephora, if I'm not mistaken. There are a couple of things that I don't even know if I should do, you know, reviews on. Because, first of all, they're all in the same kind of general nudish family. And I know, as of right now, I'm sort of kind of tired of the nudes. So... 
I don't even know if I'm gonna like there's this new there's a, a hard candy volumizing lip gloss plumping serum in the shade all American girl okay so you see that then there's this this is a Maybelline elixir in the shade nude illusion duh see there, yeah. I was going through a serious nude phase and every so often I mean it still pops up here's one this is gleam golden gleam something which is sort of like a could be a topper it could be an actual nudish nudie you know here's another one they're all in the nudie, pink nudie, beige nudie family. And if I were to just constantly keep doing these, you would be bored and so would I. So here's a Marc Jacobs one. Enamored. And this is in the shade Taboo. It's, you know, I don't even think this has much color to it. Uh, see? It's kind of like a shimmery nude. So, you know... I'll 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 do them of course, but not anytime soon. I'm feeling color right now. I don't know what it is. I'm just feeling, you know, I'm feeling a little I want some reds, I want some purples, I want some, you know, color. I want to put nude aside for a while. So God only knows when you'll see these. And I've also got some lipsticks, but I think they're in the nude family too, so I don't know. The lipsticks might be a little bit more fun to play with. Even though they're in the nudie family, there's some NYX. I think they're all NYX, come to think of it. No, there's some Black Up, Black Up Cosmetics, so I'll be doing reviews on that. There's one Vincent Longo lipstick, and I think two NYXs. So this, this pouch has a couple of goodies that you may see throughout the week and, you know, until I'm done. Not red so much, but I think a couple of, there may be a couple, maybe two nudes, a, a purple, a couple of purples. So depending on, of course, what I wear. It all depends on what I wear, people. I don't want to be just clashing all over the damn place, you know what I mean? So it all depends on what I wear. I pick out the outfit first, then I pick out my makeup. That's usually how it goes. So that's just basically that with that, people. Um, I had a really good weekend, not really doing much, believe it or not. Pop gave me a $100 bill for my birthday. So, you know, I went, well, I can't really say splurging. I went shopping. My refrigerator is bare, people. Like, like you know, the only thing that you'll find, well, now I, I, I filled it with some food. But the only thing that was sitting in there, I'm even, it's just even too pitiful to admit. It's just even too pitiful. It's sad, pathetic, and pitiful. You know the only thing that was in that refrigerator? No lie. I'm not exaggerating. I'm not even trying to be funny. This is the God's honest truth. The only thing that was in that refrigerator was my Brita water, water pitcher. But Nancy, how did you eat at night? Uh, Nancy was ordering uh, Domino's and she was ordering Chinese, or she would just bring home a McDonald's. That's how she was eating. If I said enough of this nonsense, the $100 bill that Pop gave me, I did a little bit of food shopping, so I don't look as pathetic and sorry anymore. The refrigerator has a little bit of something, something, so I don't have to spend my extra cash on junk food. But you know I love me some junk food. I went to McDonald's for lunch, though. No lie. Got me some um, McNuggets. Yes. Yeah, I haven't had McNuggets in a Stone's age. So I had to, you know, I was feeling that sweet and sour sauce. So what goes better with sweet and sour sauce than a McNugget? That's all I'm saying. But let me tell you, I was hurt to the core last week. Last Friday. I think it was Friday. I was coming home. Was it Friday? No, it was Saturday. It was Saturday. After I had done my um, my food shopping, come to think of it, I'm going down the street, and at the end of the street, 
is the corner of Springfield Boulevard, and there is a McDonald's that's right at the corner, which I usually take a pit stop in every so often. As a matter of fact, right after I was doing food shopping, I said, oh, I'm going to just head over to the, to the Mickey D's, grab me some lunch, and then go straight home. They closed it down, people. I mean, they bricked up the wall. The only thing it, that's showing is the, the yellow M. You want to talk about some hurt feelings? I, I, I really thought I was going to sit there and cry. I mean, I had to drive by it. I didn't, like, stop. I had to drive by it. But I was like, oh, they closed. Like, Friday, it must have been open. And then Saturday, they must have just closed it up. I don't know. This Mickey D's, I don't even understand it because this Mickey D's was almost pretty much 24-7. Every time you went there, there was a line. So you can't tell me that it was due to lack of business. Every time I drove in, and I always did the drive through I was backed up for six or seven cars. So, and then there were six or seven cars behind me. So you can't possibly tell me that it's because of lack of funds. Excuse me, I'm all gassy, I'm sorry. But you can't tell me it's lack of funds. That's the reason why they closed down. I mean, they bricked it up. The drive through is, is, is blocked. It had two drive throughs going in, going in this way and going in that way closed you want to talk about some hurt feelings and this was the closest one to me now of course there is another one that I can go to which I have no choice now but to go to but it's like a you know this was like a hop skip boom you're there this one it's not a trek but it's a trek you know what I mean like this one I could go in and out. Like if I left here at like 8 o'clock at night and I, I had the munchies, I could go in and maybe by 8, 20, 25, maybe 8, 30, I'd be back home. Maybe even less than that. Maybe I'd say 8, 20, I'd be back home. This other one, if I left here at 8 o'clock, I'd be back here at about maybe a quarter to nine. You know what I mean? So there's a bit of a difference, people, whether it be 15, 20 minutes or no. You know, that's <sighs> okay. So I was I'm, I'm still hurt. I'm still hurt. I am still very hurt. You're like, you gonna close Mickey D's on me? I am the quarter pounder queen. My fat ass will tell you I am the quarter pounder queen of quarter pounds on me. And, I'm, and when I'm starving, starving. Double quarter pound with cheese. That's right. But now, I'm going to have to think twice. Like, mm, do I really want to go to McDonald's? Like, this one, I didn't even have to think twice. It's like, oh, I'm feeling kind of McDonald's-ish. Let me just put on some clothes. Boom, in the car, done. In and out, done. Now, it's not going to be so easy. It's like, do you really want to go to McDonald's? Think on it. I'm very upset, people. I'm very upset. That was that was my Mickey D's. That was my Mickey D's. Been open forever. For as long high school, it was open. College, it was open. Y'all got the audacity to shut it down on 2018? On my birthday month, no less. I know I'm going on and rambling and rambling about Mickey D's, but people just don't understand. You just don't understand. Well, it's a good thing I have food in my refrigerator now. Hello? Okay, so that is really that with that upon that. Okay? This is the lip of the day. Can I just say, oh, my blush is kind of heavy on this side. What the hell? I'm home now. It don't make, make a damn bit of difference. But the lip is popping. Popping!
That is what the lips are doing. Yes. Yes. Happen. All right. So that is that. With that, upon that, that is lips of the day. Look of the day. It is what it is, people. Okay. All right. You know I love you. I love my YouTube family. Hit me up. Let me know what you think of dark wine, wet and wild. Here it is again. Wet and wild, dark wine. And I will talk to you tomorrow. One down, four more to go, people. You know I love you. Mwah. Bye now.